Hello, this is Quintero Covers. I'm going to teach you Waiting for the End by Lincoln Park. It's really easy. It's only five chords. And yeah, it's a really good song to learn. It's good for power chords, bar, chori bar chords, and just regular open chords. Alright, so first chord is going to be the E power chord. It's E or E minor. I'm not sure if you know what this power chord is, just message, just comment down below to correct me. And yeah, thanks. It's gonna be pointer finger on the seventh fret A string, ring finger on the ninth fret D string, and pinky on the ninth fret G string. That's her E, I'm gonna call it the E power chord until someone clarifies it on the comments. I'm pretty sure it is the E power chord. The next is the E, the open chord, I guess. E chord. Pointer finger on the first fret, G string, ring, ring finger on the second fret D string, middle finger on the second fret A string. Third chord is A sus two. Uh, it's like the it's like an A chord except without the ring finger. So it's pointer finger on the second fret D string and middle finger on the second fret G string. A sus two, C minor where it gets a little complicated. You bar the fourth fret, ring finger on the sixth fret D string, pinky on the sixth fret G string, and middle finger on the fifth fret B string. It be, and that should be C minor. And then the last chord is B. B power chord or B sus two. B sus two is about is barred on the second fret, ring finger on the fourth fret D string and um, fourth fret on the G string pinky. You can be B sus two like that, or you can do a B power chord where you just put your pointer finger on the second fret A string. All right, so those are the five chords. It's how to get onto the song. I'm trying to finish this song this fast so that I don't take up much of your time and you get as much information as you can. All right, so the beginning where Mike is singing the rap, where he's like, this is not the end, it's not the beginning. All you're gonna do is stay on the on the E power chord for the whole rap, both raps. When he comes back into the second time, it's gonna be the same rap, it's gonna be the same rap, the same chord, it's just the E chord. And the showing pattern for the rap is gonna be down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. Alright, here I'll I'll play a little part to see to show you how it's supposed to sound. This is not the end, this is not the beginning, just a voice like a ride, rocking them revision. And yeah, we should repeat that chord progression or repeat that strumming pattern for the whole rap for this rap and the second part where it comes back in now for the i'm gonna call this the first verse for chester right um the chord progression for this is e power chord a sus2 c minor a sus2 b sus2 or b power chord it doesn't matter okay uh so the first verse where he's singing waiting for the end i'm only doing two strums um two strums per because each chord is two measures long except when you come back to aces two after the c minor chord that's one measure and then b power chord is one measure also so it'll be two measures to equal up okay so uh it should be one two three four two two three four one two three Four, two, two, three, four, C minor, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four. Should be like waiting for the end to come, wishing I had strength to stand. This is not what I had planned. It's out of my control. I know it's not that tempo, but I'm just trying to speed up so the video's not as long as I hoped for. <laughs> All right, so when you end on that control on the B power chord, you're gonna add uh, eight strokes down and it's gonna crescendo into the second verse. And the second verse is the same chord progression as this one. So it's be down, down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then an up stroke as, an, as, an, as the ninth stroke which would help you transition to the E chord. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. 
that doesn't if that feels complicated for you just one two three four one uh, whatever you want to do right there i like to crescendo it to make it seem more uplifting anyways the second verse where he comes in flying at the speed of light um it's the same chord progression now the strumming pattern has changed to a faster strumming pattern it's pretty easy um it should be, they're both two, it, each chord is both two measures long, like last time, except the showing pattern is longer. And Aces 2 is the same one measure after you come back from the C minor. One measure, one measure. So it should be down, so it's down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. So I do that. So it should be flying at the speed of light <sighs> thoughts are spinning in my head and then you do that for the whole second verse and the third verse where he comes in and sings uh, sitting in an empty room so I'm just telling you that the verse 3 is the same thing as verse 2 okay not for the pre-chorus or chorus i guess where he says i know what it takes to move on you're just gonna do a c minor power c minor chord and aces two so it should be the same strumming pattern down so it should be uh i know what it takes to ace us two ah, da, da, the fields to lie. and right here after the light part you're gonna go into the same chord progression as the verse Except each measure is each, each chord is worth one measure, and you can use the same showing pattern. So it should be so I know how it feels to lie, uh, lie. All I want to do is trade this life for something new. C minor, da 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 da. God. And then you do the the nine strokes crescendoing into the third the third verse. That should get you through the third verse, and then also the chorus again. And the rap part for the second time is the same thing as the first one, just on the E chord, same strumming pattern as I taught you before. And then the outro comes in, and this is where the chord the chord progression changes for the whole thing. The chorus is not the same anymore. Um, it's gonna be two whole measures of. Uh, the E power chord, then C minor, then A sus 2. So after he sings, the hardest part of ending is starting again. You're going to play a, a, an outro just with the four chords, just once though. So it's going to be, so the hardest, the hardest part of that is starting again. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. comes in he sings uh where this is where chester comes back in after the o part he says and this is the same thing it's just two measures so it's all i want to do is trade this life for something new holding on to what i have in god and then he repeats to e it's the same thing as if it was e and asus too except now it's just e on e so it's just instead of those two chords, it's now on E, power chord. So after he repeats, after he sings that first part, and then the rap comes in, he sings, this is not the end, this is not the beginning. It's the same strumming pattern and chord progression all the way to the end of the song. So I'll try to mix both of them. So he's, so he's like, holding on to what I have in God. This is not the end, this is not the beginning Just a voice like a riot rocking every vision I'm holding on to what I have in God And he goes on that long thing Listen da 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 God And then end on the E power chord And that should be the whole song um, message, comment down below if you have any confusion so I can clarify really fast. Uh, I hope you liked it. It's a really fun song to play, especially since Chester's passing. I, I feel like it should be a good song to learn by them. It's a little tribute. It's a really good song. And 
yeah so if you like the video like subscribe you know all that stuff and yeah bye bye